What's up, guys? Welcome to October, because it's getting cold out here. And I'm up from uh, upstate New York, so uh, it's getting kind of cold. Now, I know I'm kind of way on this video. Everybody's kind of done it already. But uh, that up church. He's a pretty funny guy, I have to say. Love his music. He's got that awesome rock, country, rap. He does it all. And he's funny. And he did it all on his own. He's got no record label. Well, he's got kind of his record label, but no mainstream, no nothing. He did it all on his own. And he released a music video basically crapping on the mainstream country scene. And it's just hilarious. He rips into Kane Brown. He rips into Luke Combs. Him and Kane Brown are kind of like friends, but he still makes fun of them. Um him Luke Combs kind of had it falling out a little bit, so now it's kind of a little like, you know, a little butt hurt there. But nonetheless, it's still funny. I'm not gonna show you the whole video, but I'm gonna show you a couple clips. And it's just awesome. You know, he makes my mainstream and talks about you know what country really is you know the true country not just yeah hey, I'm a country boy you know I uh, my drug baby y'all driver John Deere yeah yeah nah like, he's like yo that ain't country it's his country it's how it is check it out Oh, they're going to be mad about this one, boys. Oh, well. It'll be all right. Fuck award shows. Fuck the radio. And the new up-and-comer and his female clothes. With his glitter on his face and his pre-written songs. He ain't from around here and neither is his boss. But the guy in the office with his jerry curl. And his hands super soft like a teenage girl. Got a gang cock gash while they get stabbed. There's a little no fact. I was born in Music City, still getting no slack. I got country songs tipping a hundred million. Get played at every mud park across DC. Not to mention female singers want to come and frisk me. Especially when we're stoned in my f one Country music was a rooster. You probably wouldn't know it, don't lay me. Oh, hold up. Now, I consider myself a country boy. Grew up in the woods. I may not be a true hardcore redneck, like I think I am, but I grew up on a, a small farm. We had chickens, ducks, goats, rabbits, you name it. I wake up early in the morning, feed them, let them in at night time, you know, all that stuff. So, in the song, he talks about, you know, people not knowing about the egg and the rooster. And the... That always blew my mind. The people just couldn't comprehend that you don't need a rooster to get an egg. Hens lay eggs no matter what. You only need the rooster if you want a baby chick. 
thing of this way. I don't know if uh, YouTube really like this, but I don't care. Women do something every month, correct? Whether or not they're with the man, women have eggs. Human women have eggs. And once a month, they release that egg. That's basically what a chicken does. It's the same thing. Just we can visually see the egg and we eat it because we're weird people. Chicken does that every day. So chicken, therefore, has something like a period every single day. The eggs you buy in the store are unfertilized eggs. So you don't need a rooster to get the eggs you buy in the store. I don't know if it's because I grew up with it and I learned that at a young age, but how do people still think that way? Watch this clip. Like I said, he is just destroying the mainstream and destroying the country scene. Just like, no, you guys ain't country. This is what country is. Screw the mainstream because you guys are just ruining everything. And he's freaking hilarious. Ah. Make sure you like button. Make sure you subscribe button. See you guys next time.